With some unexpected rain, the Brainerd Memorial Day Committee is pleased to bring the Memorial Day events back to pre-COVID status. Part of today's ceremony will include a reef like this that will be tossed into the Mississippi River to remember those who were lost at sea. Today is a memorial service for all the veterans that lost their lives for this country, from the Marine Corps to Coast Guard, Navy, Army, and Air Force. Then everyone moves to the courthouse for a short ceremony on behalf of veterans. Heavenly Father, we pause this day to remember and to give thanks for the multitude of soldiers, sailors, Marines, airmen, and Coast Guards. And the 21-gun salute. With a special guest and a parade, the day ends at Evergreen Cemetery, but due to weather, things were moved to the National Guard Armory Baton Memorial. A lot of this was about getting back to doing what we traditionally do here in Brainerd with the parade and going to the cemetery and, and all of the events that we have done pre-COVID. Unfortunately, the weather had a different idea. As Americans honor this day, Veteran Ron Bird honors it for a special reason. With having no right chest and beating cancer all three times, he gives all the praise to God and shared his heartfelt story and also a little humor. When I was in the way talk at all, I was supposed to have been dead, but I did not die and I refused to die. <laughs> so and the, the doctor that sewed me up, he said, you're, you're not a normal, normal person. <laughs> and I asked him, what do you mean I'm not a normal person? He says, you got hit with that davit. It took you from the ground all the way to the back of the boat. I mean, that's the hit. I didn't feel a thing. I wasn't knocked out. But they come down and they got me. But that's the little scar right here. That's been there over 60 years. And it says it'll never go away. But it, it dented my head. But it, I guess it didn't hurt my brain. <laughs> I made it through school. Okay, so. Randy Alda shared, always remember our veterans and our troops who are currently serving. They are the important part of America and they need our support. Reporting in Brainerd, Hanky Hazelton, Lakeland News. If you missed the ceremony from earlier today, you can watch the recording on Facebook. The group's name is Brainerd Memorial, or you can go to their website. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.